Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here from KiwiKing77.com and surprise, got my hands on a Galaxy S6 Edge review coming soon, but today we're going to be doing a video showing you how you can root your Galaxy S6 Edge. Ping Pong Root actually got updated and now it supports the S6 Edge, it supports the S6 as well, so this video will work for both variants. But I promised an updated video for the Edge variant, so here we go. Now it's important to note this will not trick, trip your NOx, so your warranty with Samsung is still intact. So that's really great. Now to double check and make sure your device is supported, go into settings, go to about device, and make note of that build number though after the period right there. So in my case, G925T, T is my model number and then the rest is the build number so just make note of it because in the thread you can actually see which supported models are there anyways quite simple you don't even need a computer to root it it's using ping pong root so shout out to the developer click on the link in the description of the video you can do it on your phone it's on my website you can just go here and then scroll down there's a download button select it and once you go to that download, here is the XDA thread. So shout out to Keen Team, uh, Idler, 1984, everyone that was involved in getting this going. So here is supported devices. As you can see, a long, long list, not just S6, up at the top, S6 Edge as well. So keep scrolling down, gonna give you a lot more information. I recommend reading it if you'd like to. And then down at the bottom, there's an APK download, Ping Pong Root. Right now it's beta 5.1. I'm sure that's gonna be updated in the future, but go ahead and select it. It's gonna download it to your device. I'm just gonna go ahead and select with Chrome just once. I'm gonna hit OK to keep the file, and it's going to download the APK. Now download complete, select it once it's done downloading. And then what it's gonna do is actually say install blocked if you haven't uh, done it already, but I'm gonna go to settings and then go to check unknown sources and hit okay. Now it's gonna load up ping pong root and hit install. All right, once it's done installing, just go ahead and press open and here we go. Very, uh, very simple process, honestly. So now you'll see Super SU uh, install block. So it's attempting to install Super SU, which is good. You need that. Go ahead and go back into settings, check unknown sources. You can uncheck allow this installation only if you'd like to. Press OK and install Super SU as well. All right, so once Super SU is installed, go ahead and hit done. And then I recommend go ahead and just select get root. It's gonna take a little bit of time. I'll be back once it's done. All right, and it says root done. If for any reason you have issues with it saying Super SU is not installed, you can try and reboot your device. You can just back out of it and then reinstall the Super SU app. I recommend selecting all instead of new. Select all to replace the Super SU file. So that's just a quick thing. Now it says recommend to re reboot your device. Awesome. Just go ahead and press restart. I'll be back once it's done. All right, so my device has booted back up and we should be fully rooted now. I installed an app called Root Checker Basic from the Play Store just to double check that we are actually rooted and you don't have to do this, but verify root, it's gonna pop up a super user request and that's gonna basically let us know that we are fully rooted. Okay, so this popped up as well. If you're on T-Mobile, deny it, super user permission, so make sure you deny that. But yeah, you'll see, basically, since it's asking for super user permissions, we are now rooted. You can grant Root Checker Basic if you want, but you'll see, congratulations, Root Access is installed. So hopefully this video helped you out. If it did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to me as well. Uh, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, all links in the description of the video below. And as always, guys, thank you very much for watching.